Women and girls bear the brunt of these crises. We need to enter these areas to understand and challenge the status quo. Let people understand that women can also be in charge when it comes to ICT. We can use technology to transform our society and build a sustainable environment for everyone. International Girls in ICT Day is a global initiative that aims to empower and encourage girls to pursue careers in information and communication technology. So we've seen a swift transition into a technological phase over the shortest period of time, globally. And alongside too, we have witnessed an increase in global crises like climate change, food insecurity, pandemics and the like. But unfortunately, women and girls bear the brunt of these crises. Example, climate change, food insecurity. Therefore, I believe that it's imperative for girls to build their capacity in ICT to be able to create innovative solutions to these global challenges, especially in their local communities. So before enrolling for this program, I had the expectation to, one, be able to know how to use tools like the Microsoft Office Suites, you know, spreadsheets, um, to be able to develop um, projects in a more comprehensive way for even the layman to understand, especially because I'm working on things related to environment, climate change, bringing it down to the context where grassroots can what, appreciate the concept. And all of these things I got from the program um, offered by J Grow With Google Scholarship Program. And for me, it has been an impactful journey so far. Um, interestingly enough, for the people I know who have undergone this program or who have this certification, they are all guys since I head of project management and they all did it in a span of three months. And for me, when I heard about the J program and then the scholarship, I was like, no, I need to go for this. Um, I know it's within three months, but I will challenge myself to go for this because I don't know of any female yet who has uh, had this certification so I told myself I want to sign up for this and that was my main challenge to be able to undertake this program and then finish it in a span of three months as I had a lot of activities and work going on traveling in between so in my line of work I've seen a good growth well something that is evident in my deliverables. So I have a background in agriculture and we have an upcoming project, which is sustainable food project um, under my organization. And I remember back in tertiary school, my supervisor and I literally used a pencil and a sheet to map out and draw the layout of this farm we are going to cultivate on. I've been able to use simple tools like Microsoft Office to develop a farm layout of which a layman can even understand what we are going to do there on the farm. And for me, this is a significant impact this program has had on me. I would say that going forward, young girls should be given role models, like people who have actually leveraged ICT to make change in, or to lead change in their sector. I'm from the environmental sector, and I must confess that ICT or knowledge in ICT has actually helped my work in how I deliver on tax efficiently and effectively. You know, if young people are able to see things like this, they are able to relate and know that this is actually something they need to build their capacity to lead change in their local community or wherever they find themselves. On this International um, ICT Girls Day, I would want to say to all young girls that ICT is not only for men. It is for us. It is for everyone. And if we want to be change makers in our society, in this world where we have a lot of challenges at hand, we need to take this on. We need to enter these areas to understand and challenge the status quo. Let people understand that women can also be in charge when it comes to ICT. We can use technology to transform our society and build a sustainable environment for everyone.